I'm Trady Trev and I've got you another top tip. Have you ever tried to fix an LCD monitor? They're not the easiest things to get apart. I'll show you the uh, technique I like to use. Not exactly the uh, nicest, but it does the job without having to do too much damage to it. Okay, first things first, we'll take off our base. There are a lot of different types of monitors on the market, but it's hard to find any that are, have a simple guide to pull one apart. You usually got these plastic clips that sit on the inside, taking off the front. Just make sure there's no other screws there. Start at the corner, get your flathead screwdriver, and just gently tap it until it comes out. Front of that off. Little speakers come out. Now these parts here are usually for your your backlights. Um, that's what usually lights that up. This monitor, I've got a feeling that it's just the power supply that's the issue, so I'm going to go ahead straight into that.
a beautiful day it is today. I should work outside more often. There you have it. Now I can see straight away this one here looks faulty. That one there feels fucked. And I'll just have a zoom in and I'll um, identify which, which of this power supply is stuffed. So this one here and this one here. I reckon if I replace that, I might have a keeper. Um, obviously I've got more screws there to take out to get the job done. But I'll order it and I'll see how we go. And that's how you pull apart an LCD monitor. Didn't take long and I've identified a problem which I think might fix it. Now as for the damage that has been caused by pulling it apart, I've actually broken a lot of these little clips on the inside but what you have to realise is that you can just get a bit of dab of silicon in there and back on you go and it's good as new, strong as and um, obviously I'll only do that if I've gone and fixed it that fixed the problem by changing those two capacitors If you found this video informative and you thought it was a great top tip don't forget to thumbs up I'm Trady Trev